This is a case of aneuritic IOL implantation in a patient with a failed graft, aphakia, and traumatic aneuridia. A diamond step blade set at 380 microns is used to initiate a posteriorly oriented scleral pocket, the dissection of which is completed with a crescent blade and extends approximately 2 to 3 millimeters posterior to the limbus. The aneritic IOL is then brought onto the field and a 9-0 proline suture on a long curved needle is passed through the eyelet of both haptics in preparation for implantation. Once the host cornea has been removed, a 27 gauge needle is passed approximately 1 millimeter posterior to the limbus and the long curved needle is fed into the needle and pulled out of the eye. The passes of the double armed suture are approximately a half a millimeter apart. These passes are made full thickness through the previously dissected, posteriorly oriented scleral pockets. Once all four passes have been made, the IOL is carefully placed into the eye. A Sinsky hook is then used to retrieve the ends of the sutures out of the scleral pocket once the needles have been cut off. The suture is then secured into place with one throw And again, the Sinsky hook is used to retrieve the ends of the double arm suture out of the pocket. The suture is then thrown down or tied down with one throw so that the centration, tilt, and stability of the lens can be checked. Once this has been deemed appropriate, the sutures are tied down in a 2 1 1 1 fashion. with the knot residing in the scleral pocket. The sutures are cut short this goat is played, placed on the surface the graft is placed onto the field and sewn into place with 16 interrupted 10 nylon sutures. A collagen shield soaked in Zymar and dexamethasone is then placed on the surface of the eye and the case is concluded.